Um, Michael said that like the message maybe was play for each other as opposed to with each other. Can you talk about that and the differences between the? the yeah, two? absolutely. I mean, it's um, when you play for someone, there's a lot more at stake. I think you're a lot more accountable for your actions and and how you approach each and every situation. So that's the that's the big difference for sure. So. Um, when you look at our team over the last three games, I, I think we've been very loose, um, and that's not a, a great way to play for a teammate. You know. You mentioned yesterday that losing three in a home, three yeah. in a row at home is unacceptable. I mean, how important is just making this place a fortress? And, yeah. you know. it's 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 real important. I mean, it's a tough league to win in, and I think that's one thing that's changed over the years. Um, it used to be certain arenas, they were almost impossible to win in, but the parity of the league now has made it such that if you're not at your best wherever you are, at home or on the road, there's a pretty good chance you're not winning the game. Um, so it's a little bit different nowadays in regards to home and road records that you'll see because um, when we go on the road, we feel like we can win in any building. And it used to be a little bit different when teams would go and, and play road games, but it's, that's changed a little bit. So you have to make sure you're at your best all the time. Otherwise, pretty good chance you're not getting the points that you want. So is the home thing that's a bit of a point of pride, I guess? So Absolutely. And there's people here that are, we have, we think, the greatest fans in the league. And they want to come and watch the team play hard, which I think for most nights they do. Um, they want to see a, a team that's passionate and playing hard as a team because that's really what this city kind of is all about. So it's important that we come out here and put on that type of effort every time we step on the ice. When I asked Backlund about the three losses in a row, he said the one thing about them is like they're all not they're not really the same loss, yeah. but he, but he felt like you guys let it slip through your fingers in each occasion. Is that is, yeah. is that sort of how you view it? Yeah, um, you know, I would similar to what he's saying, but I would go the other way. They are very similar in regards to how we lost those games, right? There's little plays at certain times of the games where maybe we try to do something that we shouldn't do that's come back to hurt us, and it shifts momentum a little bit in a game. So that's that's probably what I would say to that. Ryan, I have to yeah. ask you, uh, there, there's been news throughout the NHL today, uh, several players leaving their teams uh, with indefinite leaves of absence, uh, many connected to the 2018 World Junior Hockey Team. I know Dylan took his leave on Sunday for mental health reasons is what the, the team is saying. Uh, do you have any uh, comment in regards to, to that and what may, if any conversations you had with Dylan leading up Sunday. Yeah, I saw the reports this morning just like everybody else, but I, I don't have any information on it at all. I'm sorry about that.